You guys may remember the days of this routine as hell. They were a very heavy and ooh, noisy band. But they rebranded themselves as Swain and became more of like a, a post-grungy alternative rock band. And their last album didn't really impress me all that much. And I was just a bit disappointed to see that them go in a direction that was way less exciting than what they were initially doing as this routine is hell. Now that negative space is here, I can say that the album cover terrifies me, but the music itself is pretty safe. I think this is just um, pretty standard for the alt-rock sound, I think, and um, I, I, I don't think it's necessarily bad. I think it's actually quite decent. The one thing holding this album back is the vocals, not because of what this band used to sound like or used to be. I'm just talking specifically this album here because I think the vocals at times are just a bit too soft. They lack a bit of bite and it's a bit of a shame because the first three tracks on this album don't have those issues at all. I think the first track is a great introduction to the album. It gets things kicking off. You just know that you're going to get some really solid rock tunes through and through. And then the second track is the best track on the whole album, so it, I was even more excited. But just as the album goes on, I feel like it gets slightly more and more vanilla, which is really weird. I would say a common trend these days uh, with albums is that you get like the first few tracks that are great. And then after that, uh, things just take a bit of a nosedive. I, I've noticed this so many times. Uh, when you hear as many albums uh, as I have, I, I just I just think it is a bit of a weird trend. You just start getting these really soft rock tunes, and the instrumental is actually quite nice on the ears. But the guy's vocalist is just so nondescript over these instrumentals that it drags the songs down a bit. But they are nice to listen to, and the the best they they do it is the final track where. It just feels like such a wholesome ballad to end the album on and it feels like they finally get what they were going for on the previous tracks right. It just feels like some American football uh, self-titled type um, guitar tones that just sound so lovely on the ears. Nothing too crazy going on. It's quite simple but it works and it's effective. And that describes the album at its best honestly. It's very simple but it's not always effective and that's kind of where it loses it for me. But I do think it's a decent one overall. Like I did say, the first few tracks are great rock tunes, but everything else is just kind of standard, but it's not necessarily a bad thing. I think I'm gonna go six out of 10, keeping this review short, because there isn't a great deal to say, but I think it's worth highlighting that Swain is a solid band around these days for people that don't really think much about rock music or don't really have much of an interest in modern day rock music, I think Swain are definitely a band you wanna wanna be checking out and this is a good album. Thank you for watching my review, hope you enjoyed it. Have a good day, let me know your thoughts on this album as well. Tell me what else I should be reviewing and goodbye.